Yeah, we drink and play games. This is Barcadium. But we shouldn't read other people's mail without their permission. Shut up, Makoto! Makoto! That's fine. You got it. Oh, hi. Sorry. Okay. Um, well, the episode started. Hi! I, I almost skipped over so much dialogue forgetting that. Anyway. Celeste, Chihiro, you want to come with me into the pool? You want to get wet? Mm. Um, I also love how I jabbed you in the side, and I'm like, I'm the one who fucked up. Why am I jabbing you in the side? Like, <laughs> say, say your line. Say it. Say, say it, it. Say it. Say it. Say it. it. <laughs> You're like, I'm That's going by. <laughs> there is nothing I hate more than getting water on my face. Really? That's your problem? It's not your hair that's going to need a lot of work to get it wet? No? Yeah. Okay. I mean, if she's going to go through getting liquid on her face, it wouldn't be water. <sighs> Sorry, I need to give that face a moment to breathe before I say that line, which is... After you said that, that was my... <laughs> yeah, it's just like a... <clears throat> Sorry, I'll pass this time. How, how come? When you're in a funk, there's nothing better than a good swim to pull you out of it. It's clearly lotion. What else is she gonna put on her face? It's like a liquidy substance. It's how she stays pale. Oh, right. That's what everyone says. Oh, I just meant lotion. Yeah, no, look at how pale you she is. You know the number of times I've heard that line? I'm pretty <laughs> sure that only applies to you. <laughs> See? Perfect look, timing. Look, so white. Needs so much lotion. Okay, is there anything else in this room? We've done the guns. We tried to get in the boys' room. Uh, Let's I go in the girls' room. The door to the girls' room. I have no way of unlocking it, as I couldn't go in if I wanted to. Let's get shot and die. All right, let's try. Aww. Let's try other parts of the. Uh, the this. Oh wait, can we go in now? Ooh, oh, we can, we now. can go in now. Okay. Time to find that lotion. Oh God, look at that poster. <laughs> of course, <laughs> fucking course. Yuke yawn. Now this is an interesting poster. <laughs> Obviously, someone put this in the school, but is it really okay to have something like this in here? Yes, that's what the lotion's for. Title of this episode, Reasons for Having Lotion on Your Person. <laughs> See, you were sitting here thinking all perverted things, and I'm like, no, lotion, and now you can make the perverted I mean, joke. I, I've been in some locker room situations where lotion came up, and I was still, like, baffled by the lotion use. Like, I know women who are like, you get in the locker room, and they'll be like, oh, it's lotion time, right? Yeah. And they just like put so much lotion, and they come up to you like, hey, do you want some lotion? I'm like, why'd you put so much lotion in your hand? Do I look You've like a no, person you... who pays attention to lotion on, on my skin? No, I'm not. Don't offer me lotion. I'm just going to die of, of scaly skin. Don't even bother. But what would you do? <laughs> that's, the, that's the whole point of lotion, to stop your scaly skin and make it nice and smooth. I'll just die. <laughs> right. Well then. Never assume I have good skin. I you don't. now see where Ashhole stands on the on the subject of lotion. <laughs> <laughs> um, but also, uh, why do they keep putting that much lotion in their hand? Sweet pool. Too bad I can't click on it. Um, hey, what's over here? It's a door. So this is through the locker room you went in here? Lockers. Other lockers? Well, I would expect to see that at any Is that going to be before. lockers into the girls' room? Sweet! Okay. Oh, so, 102. Oh. How? Well, the trial. Oh, we got... Okay. Yeah. So, like, we went through waiting room, men's locker room, pool. I think either way we would end up here, yeah. Okay. So we uh, can leave the pool. I think we... Okay, so we clicked on the poster. Uh, can we... Anything else we should click on? I don't think anything else is really that important yet. Okay. It's showing the camera and the poster. Yeah. Oh, okay. Let's so get a bad. We'll just leave. Okay, because I want to see what else is on this floor. Yes, that's also very important. Bye, bitches. Bye. Okay, okay, okay. What are you? This is the girls' bathroom. Oh, sorry, oh, I didn't know. Oh, okay. If I ever took one step in there, I'd be a total creep in everyone else's eyes. And that'd be it for me. Just wear your romper, you'll be fine. Yeah. Okay, so no one we would can notice. go in the men's room right there. Sweet, the men's room. Um Is there a, a Monokuma coin in one of the urinals? Maybe. This is where the bathroom cleaning supplies are stored. I don't see anything useful in here. No. Ah, boo! That's the only thing we can click? Oh, boo. let's leave. 
Boo, boo game, boo. Okay, all right, all right, all right. All right, all right, oh, all right, what's up? all right. Um, that looks like going downstairs. It looks too important. No, like, is this a classroom? Yes, yeah, classroom. It's not. Oh. I don't think that's important. Um, that's downstairs. Or oh no. Oh, that's upstairs. That goes to the. We can't go there. Okay, so what, what's over here? We what? haven't unlocked that yet. You, you need area? more mana. Need yeah. more Monokuma coins to unlock that. Floor. All right, we got uh, weird chairs and shit. Oh, what's this? We got another classroom. Oh no no no! I don't think that's the classroom. That's the library. Oh, let's go to the library. I like libraries. Yeah, you love libraries. You would, you nerd. Oh, whoa, no, forget the people. What's that envelope? Okay. Someone's clearly very interested in an envelope. The shelf is covered in dust, but dust, but on the shelf is a letter. What's this? Hope Speak Academy? Indeed. As it literally says Hope Speak Office on it. It was buried under a thick layer of dust. It must have been sitting there for quite a while. Kyoko needs a lot of lotion, too. She's very pale. Well, shall we see what's inside? But we shouldn't read other people's mail without their permission. Shut up, Makoto! Makoto! Is that right? What we shouldn't do is leave this here without finding out what's inside. Oh, okay. Oh my god, you little... Okay. The I'm, moment someone's like, no, we do this, he's like, oh, okay. It's my job to be the bad person he's, here. He, he's basically um, John Mulaney, the comedian. Oh, yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I, I broke the seal on the dusty envelope and pulled out the single sheet of paper I found inside. I unfolded the paper and read. Also, Kyoko, you've been here this entire time. Why didn't you open the envelope? She was waiting for us because we're the main character. Oh, sorry. You were waiting for an idiot to come in and be like, oh shit, there's a letter. Can you imagine how rage filled you would be if you were Kyoko, but you knew you were in a game, so you had to wait on Bakoto? <laughs> yeah. Like, it's like, where is this idiot? Is he at the pool with Celeste? And Aoi and Chihiro and whoever else was there. I unfolded the paper and read what was written there from the Hope's Peak Academy Executive Office. Oh. Oh. Throughout the years we've been, we have been committed, sorry, throughout the years we have been committed to shaping the youth who will one day shape the world. Oh. We have a long proud history as an institution of higher learning with full governmental support. Oh. Our graduates into society ready to take on active leadership roles in every major job field. Uh -huh. Everyone, including pornography. I was However, say including dentists. Oh well, I mean that it, it, it is a thing. it is a it, job it's field. The same thing. They both work on teeth. Yeah. However, Hope Speak Academy must now lower the certain uh, the curtain on its glorious history for the time being. This decision was not an easy one to make, but serious issues beyond our control have made it necessary. But make no mistake, this is not the end for Hope Speak Academy. We intend to reopen our doors as soon as the issues forcing our closure have been resolved. That being said, this is the end for now. So assuming that's not fake, Host Peak is closed. This would be the case. And I would like to personally and sincerely thank everyone for your help and support over the years. For now, we are awaiting official governmental authorization to formally cease operations. What does this mean? Hmm. Hmm. The contents of this letter are quite interesting indeed. It would seem... It would seem Host Peak had stopped functioning as a school. And judging by the amount of dust the letter had collected, it doesn't seem to have happened recently. If I had to guess, I'd say this letter could be at least a year old. That's All right. a decent amount of dust. That's All a decent amount of dust. Uh, I'm trying to think of more, like, kid detectives specifically females in like the 90s because I keep going to Nancy Drew and that's not fair. I don't want to keep picking on Nancy. Nancy didn't do anything to me. Um, I... Uh... Whatever. <laughs> Hi, Kyoko. How the fuck did you know that it's at least know a year old? I know old lady detectives. Can you read... Uh, g give, me, give me an old lady detective now. Miss Merkel. All right, Miss Merkel. What? Merkel? Marple. Marble. Marple. Marple. <laughs> did she just? M A R P L E. What? Miss Marple. Oh, Marple. Marple. I thought you said Marple. No, Marple. Oh, Marple. Every episode, I'll do a different old lady detective. <laughs> Miss Marzipan. How the fuck did you know that it's at least a year old? Dare you? 
so you're saying Hope's Peak closed down at least a year ago? Most likely. The mastermind took over the abandoned school in order to put on this little performance. But that would mean that it was closed when I got here. Oh, sorry. But, the, but that would mean it was closed when I got here just a few days ago. That does seem like a problem. What could have happened there? But I didn't get that sense at all. You wouldn't know. You peed your pants on your way in. Plus, if the school had shut down, don't you think it would have been in the newspapers and stuff? That's the problem. I mean, you're saying it could have happened over a year ago, right? It but before I got here, I looked stuff up online about the school and never saw anything about this. So in other words, that must have all been part of the Mastermind's plan. They lured us all in here. Bookmark that to the back of my mind. Someone who could create a place to judge and execute people could potentially be capable of anything. Hmm. Of course, that's all assuming that this letter is real. That's true. However, if it is real though, that does solve one mystery surrounding the school. The reason there are no other students here could be because the school had already closed down. What? It is weird that we're the only class of students. Mm -hmm. There's no teachers. Yeah. Yeah, how was that not the first sign? Yeah, like, There's just a the headmaster and no teachers, and everyone's just like, oh, this is normal, I guess. Oh, it's murder time, I guess. <laughs> That's the class we're in, Murder 101. Uh, that would be a nice, simple solution. It's true. And now that we've gone to the second floor, now it's Murder 201. Oh my god, it's like a assassination classroom. Uh-huh. But then, what about this other part? This decision was not an easy one to make, but serious issues beyond our control have made it necessary. Godzilla. But make no mistake. <laughs> this is not the end for Hope Speak Academy. We intend to reopen our doors as soon as the issues forcing our closure have been resolved. What do they mean by serious issues? That's apparently why the school had to close. Mm. Is there any connection between that and what's happening to us now? Mm. No. If, if the two events are in fact connected, uncovering that connection would be a useful clue on top of figuring out the mastermind's motive. I just drank my drink like an idiot. I, I grabbed it. the best of us. I grabbed it like this, and I was like, well, I guess I'm not moving my finger now. <laughs> yeah, that's weird. Well, because I was like, because I wanted to drink it like this. Okay. Oh, that that's is still way a more weird constricting. way to do it, though. Say your line. Stop although, making me feel dumb. Although, I can't really say it anymore until I find more details. Hmm. So, in other words, only the mastermind knows the truth right now. Well, yeah. Biakula, Avi. You're turning into me, and it's amazing. <laughs> the mastermind's motive. I think I started this episode on the wrong foot. <laughs> this whole episode turned because of the first like 30 seconds. Um, if we could figure out why they would uh, would want to imprison us all here, would that be enough to get us out of here? I don't or... know. All I know is there's more shit I want to click on. Okay, All right. before the people. Boomy! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm absolutely just, I am absolutely shocked! How come? Damnation! <laughs> they have all these books here and not one copy of any of my works! Yeah, why would they have comics in a library, you noob? <laughs> Plus, most fanfic is just porn drawn by a bunch of amateurs. Listen, it's not porn. Fanfic is not it's fan art. It's erotic novels. Fanfic is not fan art. There's no drawing. That is also true, yes. But let's be let's be honest. Fan fiction is just erotic novels. <laughs> it was the most like like to you it's like I punched you in the mouth to everyone else it's like I don't understand that jab <laughs> you, you just don't get it not at all congratulations you're Hifumi <laughs> I, 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 I do too get it she also writes porn Oh, face. definitely. Look that, that face. That face writes porn. Yeah. And with a face like yours, anyone can tell nothing you do is worthwhile. 
<laughs> just getting very aggressive. Well, I'd be pissed off too. You're making fun of my my my, my work. She's making fun of his work. I know. She's being aggressive. Oh, she. Yeah, I thought yeah, I thought she, you meant he. I'm no, no, like, no, you know, I would be. She's being weirdly aggressive. Oh yeah. She, well, she's kind of a, you know, you know, I, I, unlikable person. Oh okay. Just being a bitch. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Say whatever you want about me, but never judge a book by its author. You know nothing. Now hear this. Appearances mean nothing at all. What you see before you is nothing more than the vine that contains the meaty pulp of my genius. Let's not make that metaphor. I don't want to know anything about your meaty pulp of anything. Here we go. Here we go. My creations are what determine my meaning and value. You're so... <laughs> Full of it. I want you in a coffin. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I want to know where your brain thought that was going and then how, how, how much funnier it was when I just said. <laughs> I... My brain, like, I don't even know what I was expecting because when you said coffin, my brain suddenly went and I imagined her, like, Undertaker coming out of a coffin. <laughs> but you were like, I got you in the coffin, and then she comes back up, and you're like, no! She seems like the kind of person who would yeah, be capable that, of that, that's all. Honestly. That's what happened to my brain in, like, two seconds. Hmm. I use, I'm used to being misunderstood. You think weak attacks like yours will drop my HP? Uh... Those two really worry me. For once, I'm with you, Makoto. Okay, can I? I want to click on those two books in front of Toka. Byakuya! No, okay, fine. You can't even um, click them anyway. You would have clicked on Toka. Fine, we'll click on Byakuya. No, we can click on the books behind it. Okay, let's do that. Or right, you want to look around and see what we can possibly click? Ooh, look, a laptop over here. You want to click the laptop? Yeah. You want to click the laptop? I didn't get over there. Hey, yet. I'll even yeah. let you press X. Oh, look, she clicked the laptop. I'm letting her play the games. Aren't I so nice? <laughs> it looks like a laptop. Yes, thing. <laughs> the laptop looks pretty old. It's all covered in dust. So, it's broken. I tried pressing the power button earlier, but nothing happened. It's we should get it to Ch 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 Chihiro. I fucking stuttered on that word. Wow, no, there it was. I thought you were, like, I thought Toko's line came up for a second, and then nope, just, I realized, no, that's just you. There's my stutter. Oh, but you, that's so adorable. That hilarious. Name, <laughs> that name is a computer person, gives a broken laptop to that person, and then they can hate us for being like, we only value you for your computer knowledge. I, I did one of my favorite things to do while ad-libbing. It was just like, you mentioned your stuff, and I was like, oh, that's adorable. And I was like, no, make it sound worse. And I was like, adorably hilarious. <laughs> I would be interested, because I can't keep up with everything we put out. Because mm -hmm. we record, like, so many hours, and it comes out. If there is anyone who watches everything that we do... Do a compilation of every time it, Ash stutters. Is it what I'm thinking that I have only ever stuttered in this game? Because I'd be interested to know that. I think the only time we've been aware of it is this game. Yeah. Yes. Where I do a character with a starter and... So Toko really brings it out. Yeah. It's broken, huh? Too bad. You should fix that. <laughs> I mean, the laptop. I was hoping I could get uh, use it to go online and see what's going on in the outside world. If it's broken, there's nothing I can really do about it. Smash! Anyway, now I have a pretty good idea of what's going on on the second floor. There's nothing else? But I didn't see anything that might lead to any kind of exit or anything. All I can do now is hope someone else found something worthwhile. Okay, I better head to the dining hall as soon as possible. We did, did, we, Bye, everybody! We talk to everybody. <sighs> you missed your chance. You wanted to click on things and not talk to people. Listen to me! Would you like a hug? Would a hug make you feel better? You click on objects would you before like, you click on objects before people. Would you like a little pat on the shoulder? Does that make you feel it's better? It's okay. I don't care about Toko or Biakua. Is it too condescending? Oh. So. Oh. It would have been worse if other things, but it's okay. I blame you clicking the laptop. Clearly, uh, it was the end. Mm -hmm. You click that item and you're done. It's okay. I How tried dare to. You? you know, I tried to warn you by clicking specifically on Hafumi. Because I knew the well, second. I, I wanted to click other things, and you're like laptop. Because <laughs> well, I, I was like, like oh, do, okay. do you want to click on things? I was like, all right, let's get out of here then. 
You made the choice. You knew what you were doing. That's why I was like, let's click on people. Because I knew the second we went to objects, you would be fucked. Well, why did you say click on the laptop? Because we were going to eventually get there. You know what I mean? Like, it's like we were going to click on all the objects and not talk to anybody. I was like, You could right. have been like, hey, but really, there's an object. Don't click until you do the people. But instead, you're like, laptop? That's a dick move. It is. But also, you're playing this cold, so it's different. That's still a dick move. It is. <laughs> okay, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> how'd it go? Did anyone discover any interesting new th anything? Yes, indeed. Your mom. There's a library. Okay. And a pool. A freaking pool. And locker rooms filled with exercise equipment. And a Gatling gun. Oh, sorry, did I forget to mention that? <laughs> well. There was not, however, anything resembling an escape route. Yeah, she's right. Well, hey, there's no reason to get all sulky. Wait till you hear about my amazing discovery. Oh boy. What'd you discover? Right, down and listen. The warehouse and bathhouse on the first floor of the dorms are now open. We should have looked at me? that. I asked if we should look downstairs. You're like, let's go upstairs. They wouldn't have. They wouldn't have let us go downstairs oh. anyway. Okay. That's why I didn't waste my time. Okay. Now we'll get to go see them. Oh, now that he's announced them, then we can yes, go look. Yes. Oh. Yes. Yes. I, I will do some things in, like intentionally. Occasionally if, you're a dick if and you're, other times you're not. Yes. If I, if you're driving a point to do something and I'm like, well, this isn't going to get to where you want, so let's just get this over with, I'll be like, let's just get this over with. Mm. Um, and other times but you're like, click you. on the laptop. But other times I'm just like, click on whatever you want, sure. <laughs> Um, and the where and the warehouse is chock full of food, clothes, whatever you want. There's so much it's insane. <laughs> what kind of clothes are in the warehouse? So go ahead and stuff yourself to the gills whenever you feel like. <laughs> well, what kind of clothes are, are in the warehouse? Okay you? Keep in, oh sorry. Keep in mind, of course, that going out at nighttime is still prohibited. Please do not forget. Oh, Celeste, he cares about rules. Yo. I don't know that so much caring for rules as keeping people as known quantities. She likes order. For herself. That's fine. I like there's a difference. Whether That's you fine. like her or not, there's a difference between hey, liking. Hey, listen, I, I like. Taka likes order for order's sake. I think Celeste likes order to know what people are doing. That's fine. As long as that order is not trying to fuck me over, I'm okay with this. I don't know with her yet. I don't know. Go Betty but, bye. But that's what I think is going on with her. Okay. Okay. And what <clears throat> What about a fucking way out of here? You find anything like that? Oh, well, um. I'm sorry. What were you doing, Mondo? Are you picking on Taka? What did you do? Nothing? You take a shit? Is that why you took up time and space doing nothing? I'm just taking up for Taka right now because Mondo's being a dick. What? Yeah. What? Yeah, what well he said. There wasn't anything in the warehouse we could use to get our asses out of here. Nothing. Why? Why? What were you doing? Uh, uh, unfortunately, no. Not that I saw. Hey, come on. You fucking people. What? Who gives a shit if we have a goddamn pool now? Or a warehouse or whatever the fuck? Stop fucking around. We're still trapped in this place at a piece of shit school. We need to find a goddamn way out. <laughs> Now I'm Celeste. She's, she's now, on the now. chill train. There is no point in taking your anger out on us. See? It's all good. Adaptation is the key, yes? For now, we must each find a way to enjoy our current situation. You piece of... Hey, yeah, you, yeah, you better shut your mouth before you say it. You useless guy. Yeah. Whatever you say, you fucking loon. Next Boom. time on Arcadium, I murdered Bondo in his sleep. No. <clears throat> for now, Aww. for now, let's just continue our investigation and let everyone know if you should discover something. So then, so are we done for today? Yeah, the Kyoko's just like, I'm done with this shit. Can I go? I really like Kyoko. Yeah. Well, well, yeah. I guess so. Aww, Taka. Taka's doing his fucking Aww, best, and Kyoko's right. being dismissive as shit. Well, she's not as big of a dick as everyone else. So emotionally unavailable. The I like seemed, that. The ears seem to suddenly grow heavy again. Was this the mastermind's plan? To give us hope? Just to turn around and betray that hope? Alright. 
Makoto being gay by noticing Byakuya saying <laughs> <laughs> Let me zero in on you who is doing Oh, that. do you ship it? Is that is that I'm your first? I'm starting to after that. Is that your first gay <laughs> ship of the I entire? The well, actually, everything you ship thus far is pretty gay. I ship all the gay things. All, every every all the gay every. Oh wait, I it. told you off screen. I I ship Hifumi getting over his 2D girl thing with Monokuma. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> That's my crack ship. He's 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 you're shipping him with a cotton bear. It's better than 2D girls. We're, we're moving them up in the 3D. So there's a cool feature on YouTube that's known as an interactive poll. Please <laughs> vote now. Better for Ufumi. 2D figures or cotton stuffed bear? <laughs> Never thought this would be the first time I would ever use this function. But here we are. I mean, obviously Monica is a bad guy. Take that out of it. <laughs> That, that, no, that has nothing to do with it. Whether he's good or bad has nothing to do with this. <laughs> just an, just answer the poll as truthfully as you'd like. Soon the doors to the dining hall will be locked. And entry at that point is strictly prohibited. Here you are unleashing, uh, what, 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 what do you call them? No, um, no. No TP. No, the, yeah, there it is. No TP. You, f you found one. <laughs> well, no okay, TPs then. and crack Sweet ships. Dreams, are, everyone. It's, it's good a night. tight line. Sleep tight. Tight line. Don't let the bed bug bite. This is the perfect game for crack ships, no TPs, no T3s, and. To be fair, yes, this game is batshit crazy. Yeah. We all promise not to leave our dorm, uh, leave our rooms during nighttime. There's not much else to do. I guess I'll just go to bed. See you next episode. Then I'm gonna go uh, grab a nice like little I'm nap right here. Go get my ass not messed up. Oh, you took my cane. How will I ever leave? I'm going to sleep. Bye. Oh, but my ass is asleep. It's it's so asleep. Oh, nice. We can go to sleep together. My, my, <laughs> my childhood nickname is coming back to me. B Bony butt? That's Miss Bony butt. <laughs>